Hello and welcome to the Cars Land Cup Series at Indianapolis. As we have here are six drivers locked into the playoffs. Today, um, two more will join them into this. And um, this is the last race before the playoffs. And all six of these drivers are fighting for the season championship here. Ryan Newman will be starting pole in this race. And all six of these drivers will be racing for a championship. After, after today's race, the next race will have two races. The race nine will be the elimination race of the round eight. And then the, round, the championship four will be set post race nine. And this is our field, or this is our track right here. And um, let's get the cars on the track, and we'll go green just in a little bit. Green flag is in the air here in Indianapolis. Ryan Newman and Martin Truex Jr. leading them to the start. Martin Truex Jr. leading the field to turn two. And craziness for third and fourth and possibly even fifth. Oh, and we have a crash on the front stretch. The 43 has got turned around by the, 50, the 94. It doesn't look like the 43 has too much damage. Just a slight kiss to the wall spinning through the front stretch. They will probably continue. Um, they were already in the back, so this shouldn't hurt them too much. Just uh, now a loss of time now restarting lap three. Green flag in the air for Martin Truex Jr. and Ryan Newman as they battle it out once again, lap three. Ryan Newman fighting for the lead here. Ryan Newman will take the lead. Alex Bowman going to give him a bump. And this, as you can tell, this the field is a lot more organized on this restart than they were in the last one. Oh, and crash in turn one. Paul Menard sliding into it. Hard hit for Denny Hamlin. They're wrecking in turn one. And unfortunately for Bill Elliott, he will not win the season championship. Now currently leading that is, a tw is the 31 in the lead right now. And we're lap 5, we're halfway. 43 got damaged. It looks like they'll probably make it back out on the track. These are all the cars involved in the crash right here shown on display right now. And um, only one of those will continue. Um... Very unfortunate for those drivers. What happened was the 88 of Dale Jarrett dove into turn one three wide with the 96 CAT Chevrolet and the 11 who got the most damage and the hardest hit. And they slid up the track. They went, they span out, slid up the track. The 11 uh, rear ended into the track. And then the 96 came and hit the 11 and who came slamming into the wall. And then back in the pack, the 27 was not aware of everyone slowing down, and um, I would say just rammed it through everyone. And for the 94, nowhere to go. The the 18, the 43 were early able to escape through. 43 did get some damage. The 18 in the back, they're okay. Didn't get much damage there. And we're going to restart lap five. Five to well, um, we're halfway. Green flags in the air, the 31 versus the 78 once again. Once again, Truex takes the lead, and I am telling you, Alex Bowman is trying so hard to take the lead as the laps are winding down fast. Oh, and Alex Bowman's loose off too. Crashes everywhere, the 31's around, crash in the front of the track, and there's one coming into turn four, turn three. Crash only gets bigger, the 78 is this is the big this is a big one here I think only two cars are come out with a full minimal damage 14 didn't come out with any damage at all and everyone else has got too much damage to continue the race now it's gonna be a showdown between between the 14 and the 24 um, lap 7 the 24 repairing some small splitter damage and some small side damage. And the 14 is the only one that didn't come out with any damage. So 14 could 
easily win this race. And or to completely disrupt the entire playoff sequence. And, and the 24 and the 14 are guaranteed the 7th and 8th spot there. Right, and in the playoffs. And 31 and Ryan Newman declared the season champion since all the other playoff drivers are out of the race. So, either way, these guys are going to make it to the, to the, champ, the round of 8, but I think the 14's got the win here. So, only one way to determine that. Green flag in the air for the 14, the 24. Never mind, the 24 way ahead of the 14 on the start. There's the four, There's the 24 versus the 13 com, versus the 14 right there. The 24 well, amazingly leading this thing. I guess I was wrong. They did their splitter damage was really minimal, and so is their side damage. I didn't think they'd have much of an advantage at all, but they might have something here. 14 gonna try and come back and do something before lap eight comes into play. 24 got the fastest lap there. The 14 is not ready to back down yet. Amazingly, it looks like the 24 might be pulling away just a bit. The 14 closed up that lead big time through the back stretch and able to keep up through three. And the 24 still leading. The 14 gained a little bit there. And the 24 once again pulls away. And the 14 there had the fastest lap. And it's lap eight now. And the 14 comes up to the rear. The 24 again looks like Turn 2 is the 14's big gaining area, but the 24 has turn 1 as the big pulling away area. So we'll have to see which one gets the better thing here, but the 14 not only has to have these advantages, they also have to have an opportunity to pass, and that's not going to be easy. The 24 pulls away just a bit right there. The 24 has a faster lap that time. I think they kind of broke even just a tad there. We're going to have to wait till we see what we see coming into the back stretch there. Two to go. The 14 didn't quite catch up as much as he would have hoped there. One lap to go for these two. And the 14 gained a big amount through one. Let's see what he can get here through two. Clint Boyer in the 14 goes to the top of the racetrack trying to take the lead in the backstretch. He gets it through three. Let's see what the 24 has through four. They come off a of turn four side by side. The 24 taking the lead by, by shoving the 14. The 14 shoves the 24, he still wins. There we go, right there. The 24 comes up on top, leading the most laps, believe it or not. Well, no, the 31 led the most laps today and got the season championship. And these two will race for the round, the cha for the championship four chance in just a couple races. They'll, tr they'll, have one, they'll have two races to gain enough points to get in there. Maybe even a win or two. And the round eight is set. 24 wins here today at Indianapolis. Connie Ragsdale crew chief. This is their first win this season. Out of 10 races, they won race seven. Congratulations to the 24. And thank you for watching. We'll see you guys next time on Zach 3 TV and the Cars Land Cup Series. Peace.